Um, I started playing AJGA when I was about 16 years old, so about two years ago. Um, I think I was about 15 when I played the Mistwood one, and I think that was like my first tournament that I kind of got started. I was like, okay, AJGA is really fun and really good experience and opportunity to just play with better players out there, people that are older than me, and just a great experience and playing tough courses and just traveling around the Midwest areas. It's just been an amazing experience and I've like been comfortable to just play different courses and ADGA has definitely put a huge impact on where I wanted to go to college too. Yeah, so I started playing AJGAs, I'd say three to four summers ago, and I started with uh, uh, preseasons, and I uh, played good in a preseason, so I got a couple stars, and then just kind of kept working my way up, and I ended up getting a top five in an AJGA, I think it was last year, so I had fully exempt status, which has opened a lot of doors for me and allowed me to play a lot of cool courses and cool tournaments. The, the way that the AJGA sets up their tournaments, I think they're definitely preparing kids for college, and. Uh, if you can play good on these courses, I think that it's going to be easy to make the transition to the next level. So that's one thing that they do really well. AJGA has been great. Um, I've met some of my best friends through AJGA. Um, it's, I mean, it's the best run organization for sure. The way that they, we play quick rounds, care for the course, everything about it just seems to emulate a professional, a professional tournament, which is awesome. Um, it's given me a great chance to get in front of college coaches. Uh, it's helped a lot with the recruiting process. It's just a great organ organization. Probably the atmosphere. Um, I mean, college golf is going to be great. I know that. But uh, just kind of going to a tournament, especially I'm from Texas, so you go to a Texas tournament and every single person there is your buddy that you know. And, uh, I'll miss that aspect of it for sure. Uh, I think this is my fifth year now playing AJGA um, and the AJGA starting from junior all-stars and even qualifiers um, to getting to play in bigger events like the Heather Farr. Um, it's been a really cool experience and I think it's helped me grow not only in my golf game but as a person um, and it certainly has led me, me to be able to play in college. Yeah, I mean I kind of in eighth grade I kind of sat down with my dad and decided that I really wanted to play collegiate golf. and. Obviously, um, the AJJ was definitely a path that was necessary and has really helped me um, to play and it allowed me uh, national exposure um, all up and down for me, the West Coast, um, and even I've been to Texas now, I've now been to Wisconsin. Um, so getting to play against the best kids from all over the country, I think, was a good measuring stick for me um, and I was able to show the coach that I was talking to um, that I could kind of play in all different kind of weathers and courses. Um, and obviously the recruiting process was very stressful, um, but uh, you know I was able to find a school that I absolutely fell in love with. Um, and I think with how I played in AJJ and the AJJ itself, just kind of teach me to grow up a little bit um, and mature. Um, I think that's one part that really enabled me to play collegiate golf. Yeah, AJJ has definitely opened a lot of doors for me uh, through the recruiting process. I. I started off when I first started, I didn't have any college recruitment at all and then kind of played my in the AJGA and gained a lot of experience and started getting some looks from colleges, which is an awesome feeling and then ended up picking the college of my dreams, which is uh, huge just thanks to AJGA.